Hey, what's going on, guys? Thrashback here. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome to your new NHL 20 HUD event, Winter National, with your advent calendar. This is basically gifts of giving, by the way. It's not quite the same, but I'm going to go through it, give you everything you need to know. But basically, you're getting free stuff. So there you go. Now, the first things first, you can see that little pack on Friday the 6th. Now, it's Monday to Friday. You're going to get a free pack from the store. The pack can be bought right here. Like I said, it's free. You click on it, here you go. Now, I've already opened mine. You only get one. You only get one per day. But in that pack, you get a silver collectible. And today, we got an icon collectible. Now, I doubt you're gonna get an icon collectible every day, but we got one here today. Maybe a gold collectible some days, maybe uh, double silver collectibles, whatever. Now, the icon collectibles are nice, but the silver collectibles are going to be traded in for international junior items. Now, obviously the junior cards, I don't believe are out yet, which could be really interesting. They might be the uh, like the World Junior cards that come uh, starting on Boxing Day. So that, that could be really cool. That could be a lot of fun. We do have new Masters out, which include Roman Yossi, Sedeno Chara, and Peter Mrazic, and a bunch of new players, including Quinn Hughes with a 91 overall wicked card. Probably the best left defenseman in the game. Just saying. I need to get my hands on this card. You can see a bunch of the players there. We're going to go through all of them. Don't worry. And these are all your new base gold cards. Quinn Hughes, we got Adam Fox in there, we got Gusev, and we got Hiroshi. Some great names in there. I'm excited to play around with these guys, as we haven't used them yet. There's also some prime times out, but nothing crazy, unfortunately. However, that Zuccarello is probably the fastest card in the game, so if you want to get your hands on that, I suggest it. Going through all of your cards, we have the 93 Chara, which is crazy. However, unfortunately, not the best shot. The rest of the card looks sick, but the shot's not great. We have Roman Yossi. Now, I'm going to go somewhat slow through these, but if you want to take a, a second and pause the game so you can take a look at the card, that makes sense. I don't want to spend too much time on each card. However, this Quinn Hughes is disgusting, and I need him on my team. We've got Larry Murphy, obviously former Red Wing, big fan of his. We've got Kuznetsov. We've got Nrupe. We've got Vanek. Ehlers, there's some really, really cool cards in here. Krubauer and Sakara. Uh, we got Gergensons. Hogan, Granlund, and now we have Vlasic, Louis Erickson, Ryan Kessler, Marcel Gosh, Gok, Gosh. We have Anton Bernard and Vladislav Kolyachakinova. I pulled this guy three times already today. I pulled him three times. Two of them are untradeable. Okay, it's irritating. <laughs> now your free cards from the challenges are going to be Gosh, Kessler, Erickson, Vlasic, and Granlund. I'll go through them. Don't worry, you get to see everything. But we'll go through every card here. I, I mean, he has great face-offs, however, no shot. Kessler, great face-offs, not a great shot. Louis Erickson, pretty well-rounded card. Um, if I had to choose to be between Erickson, Vlasic looks awful because of his shot, and Granlin. Granlin looks amazing. Um, I'll probably go with Granlin, as honestly, he's probably the best one. Erickson looks okay, but yeah, Granlin's just so much better, I think. Now, as you can see, they also have the 85 versions and the 84 versions of those cards. Don't worry about those guys. Now, you can get them if you want, but trust me when I say you're going to want to go after the 86s. Don't sell yourself short. As for your new sets, you trade in 50 players for a gold collectible. Pretty standard stuff. 33% chance. Uh, trade in four collectibles for a player. We actually did that on stream, and I will show you. We have the Peter Mrazic, the Yossi, and the Chara. You can see the different sets for each one here. Uh, 10 gold collectibles for an untradeable one, 12 for a tradable, and then 9 gold collectibles and his prime time for an, an untradeable uh, upgraded card. So kind of cool how they're doing it, but it, again, it's copy-paste. It's copy-paste, and I'm not... I don't know. I feel like we should be uh, getting a little bit more chances out of this. Should be more things happening. I, I just feel like it's too similar to every other event, you know? So there you go. 15 for Chara. Holy. Chara's expensive, boys. Chara's expensive. As for your other rewards, your challenge reward, base pack and a choice of 1 of 5, 84 overall, a premium pack and a cho choice of 1 of 5, 85 overall, a prime, a gold collectible, and a choice of an 86. This is the one you want to do. And we also have this one, the Junior International Choice Pack. That's going to be where you get your silver rewards. Now, you trade in your silver collectibles, you get this player, there's 14 of them. Get as many as you can. Get as many silver collectibles as you can. For the love of God, do it. Now, we don't know yet what players are going to be available to choose from, so I can't help you out with that. But we do have new challenges, and we're also starting progression rewards today, which is kind of exciting. We have block five shots, and you get a two-goal player pack for doing this. Now, there are five 
progression tiers. I don't know what the reward is at the end, but uh, as we uh, work towards doing them, I will uh, definitely keep you guys updated with that. No new uh, milestone objectives or anything like that. I know a lot of people are going to ask. There's nothing new there, but uh, I, I will say I like this event. I think it's a lot of fun. I think it's pretty cool. There's different cards going on now. Yes, it's copy-paste, but I like the fact that we have different things happening. We have Quinn Hughes in the game now. We have some really cool upgraded cards. I just wish there was a little bit more to do. As for your hut challenges, your weekday challenges will get you a Winter National Collectible. Now, we do actually have challenges to do, and it looks, looks like we might be getting more, as we only have five here, which seems kind of small. But we have a mini pack, a Winter National Master Item Loan Pack, a healing and contracts pack, you know, you want to get your hands on that. 500 coins and then a base pack. So I definitely feel like the more challenges you do, the better things are going to come out. I do not feel like that's it for challenges. There's definitely going to be more, in my opinion. Now, guys, on stream, we opened up this 100k pack. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that. We also did the four gold collectible to player items. So I did that. I'm going to go ahead and show you that here. And, uh, I mean, I got some pretty good luck in the, in the one pack, but man... That one card just needs to stop popping up. Hey, let's do it. I'm getting Kuznetsov. He might make the team. Tommy Thompson! What? You know what? You know what? I have a better idea. I have a better idea, boys. I'm leaving. I'm going to go through the pack. You guys can watch. And when I come in, you guys can either make fun of me or freak out with me. Let's go. Alright, what did I get? What did I get? And I see laughing. 85, seriously? Vladislav Kolyachonk. Chonkok. Chonok? Chonok? Chonkok. I like that better. The song is Teenage Lullaby by Oi. Taiku is nice, buddy. Good for you, man. That's awesome. What's the calendar? It's an advent calendar for your uh, silver collectibles. Steve Nash, let's go. This isn't basketball porn. Are you broken? What's it gonna be? Why is this guy just popping up everywhere? Why is this a thing? I already have him. I don't want him. Okay, okay, wait, I'll take it, I'll take it. We got Kuznetsov on the 89, that's sick. That's awesome. No, I need, I need this huge, man. I need this huge. Come on. All right. Yeah, Chon Clock is a, he's a troll. There you go. <laughs> Monitor's off. Antonio, good to see you, man. I need your luck. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Or am I throwing this away and being mad? Meh. Well, I don't want to hear that. You guys are making this. Brian, why are you texting me? Oh, I got Grubauer. Okay. Well, I guess Kuznetsov is 100% who I'm taking. And now we're going to sell him. New challenges? Yes. But no. Last time we looked, they weren't there yet. Why missed a free card if not here on Christmas? I have no idea. No, no, no. You're fine. You're fine. Kid! Get out of my packs! Why do you do this to me? What is We got pretty lucky there with the Kuznetsov. Unfortunately, nothing else in the packs here today. But we will do a 20k pack. One last 20k pack. To try and get something big. No purple pulls. Now, we got some 85 pluses today. But no purple pulls, which is kind of upsetting. So I need to see some purple. Let me get a master here. That's all I want. <laughs> Imagine. All right, Evander Kane, 81. That's probably our best pull of the pack, too. Unfortunately, no pack luck here today, boys. A couple 80 overall cards. Cool, but... Anything? Last card? It's a bust. Here's the odds for every pack. Um, nothing insane, unfortunately. 
you don't get like a guaranteed anything except for in your 100k pack where you are guaranteed a gold collectible and I mean you're guaranteed an 85 plus but it is 100k so it is what it is you know but I will I will take this I'm, I'm happy with this I like this event new free pack in the store Monday to Friday make sure you get them I'm not gonna be able to get them all I'm gonna have to uh, figure out a way to play while I'm on this cruise ship because there's no way in hell I can get them all and this is a bad time for me to be missing out on collectibles and shit bad timing game Anyways, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Unfortunately, no crazy back luck, but we do have a pretty nice new event. I like it. I think that it's a lot of fun. And hopefully we can bring, uh, bring ourselves some brand new crazy good cards. And I like the idea of these progression challenges. Who knows what the, uh, the final reward at the end is going to be. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you later.